Hey, what is happening, people? We're watching some Halo Reach gameplay today. My name is Chippy, and I'm gonna be speaking over the top of it because that's what I do. I like to post Halo Reach videos and put the money in it. <laughs> so, um, I never really know what to do with my channel because I, uh, I've been getting uh, more and more subscribers as I've gone along, and. Uh, but I never seem to get many views on my videos, so I, I, I still want to be churning out some content for my my channel. Just making me, you know, just, just enough just to keep it going and making me look cool. So hey guys, if you're subscribed to my channel, I'm liking you a lot. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, I urge you to. Because it's cool. Anyway, this is some gameplay that I promised um, from GXPTube. Um, when I was on GXPTube, I said I was going to do this I, because I've... I already have this game saved. I mean, the lovely thing about the Halo Reach is the the whole Forge thing that you can save games on. So it means that I'm not running my uh, I'm not having to run my HD PVR all the time, and I can just look over a game. I can, um, you know, I I, I, I can just come back to it and look it over. Sorry if I sound a bit fucking alone, because I've just woken up. It is half four on a Friday. Um, I always have a half day on a Friday because that's what my company does, and you know that's what happens, dude. <laughs> so yeah, I, I have a half day on a Friday, and I'm always really tuckered because of like the rest of the week. And I'm not probably not very well at the moment anyway. So uh, I've only just woken up. So if I sound a bit daisy, if I fall asleep, I'm not gonna fall asleep again, obviously. But uh, <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, yeah, so. Uh, another thing, uh, my, my video just went up on GXPQ and it's really silly because I was like, whoa, my, my mic quality is amazing, dude. And just like throughout the whole thing, I think I had it too close to my mouth. So I'm, I'm going to be a lot more aware about that now because I don't want to be t talking too much with it, with it like under my nose because it sounds like there's a badger in a bin somewhere. It's like, <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. So anyway, uh, yeah, we're going on with this sort of... Um, gravity hammer thing going on here um, I'd probably get like a 10 kill streak. I mean it's stretched over quite a long period because Halo is only 4 and 4 uh, when I'm playing that anyway and uh, yeah I, I'm really enjoying this game at the moment let me think what I'm enjoying about it though I mean what I'm enjoying the most is that everybody starts on level pegs I mean you know there's no noob tubes there's nothing like that and Everybody just seems to have an equal an equal place to start in every game and you know it, it just seems like the better team will always win rather than who's ever, whoever is using better weapons, well obviously better weapons but you know what I mean it's a nice level pegging sort of thing to be playing and, and it's quite refreshing which is quite strange I mean um, Halo 3 is an amazing game um, and obviously it doesn't compare to things like Battlefield and Modern Warfare 2 and things like that. But, um, you know, it's very much in its own right, very good. Have that, you bastard. So, yeah, I, I am really enjoying this at the moment, but, you know, it, it would never take away the experience of Modern Warfare 2 or Battlefield Bad Company 2 for me. So, you know, I, I have a feeling that once I buy Halo Reach outright, I mean, when the game comes out, which is for the some time, I think it is, um... I have a feeling I'm going to be still playing all of them and, and enjoying them equally, probably, just because they are completely different experiences, and I, and I wouldn't be able to, uh, wouldn't be able to uh, compare them if if I wanted to. So that's good. I can obviously criticise all. <laughs> it's because I'm a bastard like that. But anyway, we're going to be looking. Let look at the gameplay still going on. I mean, uh, I think I've got lucky quite a few times. Um, I've been playing pretty tactically. Boosh. I've been playing pretty tactically. Um, the thing about Halo Reach is, of course, it's the return of the health bar, which uh, just brings a whole new different dynamic to the Halo gameplay. I, I never played Halo 1. Um, I played Halo 2, but only when I was like around my cousins sometimes. So, you know, I, I never had an Xbox, I was always a PS2 guy, but obviously I got converted when the third generation consoles came out. So. That's pretty good. I mean, third generation of PlayStation. I'm tired. <laughs> Don't listen to me. Don't you crazy cat. 
Anyway, uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep on watching some gameplay. I think this is almost over now. And I probably die. Oh, I think I die so stupidly as well. Oh god. Yeah, I think I'm on like. Z I think my um, my gravity hammer is out of out of its oomph right now, and I don't realize that until I, I come around this corner. So I pull out my gun. I hit that guy. I don't know if I hit him or not. And I got killed. That was great. Good, good times. But anyway, we're going to start looking at some Forge gameplay here. Because you go into Forge and you can just watch a whole game, what's happened elsewhere. And this is something that I really loved in Halo 3. And I think really made Halo 3 an amazing thing. I, I just wanted to like... Just be able to look around and forge, look at all the things that are happening. And of course, Halo Reach is absolutely stunning with graphics and things like that. I mean, Halo ODST looked amazing, but, um, you know, it, it, it was a more advanced version of the Halo engine that they used to make it. But this is, this is something that's, you know, a, a much, much more refined engine that they made Halo Reach with. And I think, I think I'm going to zoom in in a second. And we're just going to have a look around the characters, and you, you can really see all of the detail that you, you know you're looking at. So you can see the jetpacks there. You can see all the characters. I mean, uh, you could buy all these different upgrades for your armor and things like that. And uh, that's going to be something that you can really pick up on in Forge, and uh, I think that gives boosts to you within the game as well. Your different armor types. Okay, so here we are. We're look. We're just about to see some crazy, crappy uh, assassination going on here. Have you ready for this? <laughs> now that is pretty cool. That is a nice addition to Halo, and I, that made me like sweat my pants. <laughs> Not quite, but you know what I mean. Uh, yeah, it, it, that is something that's really nice, and uh, I think that. Another thing, I, I mentioned this in my other video that went up on GXP2. Um, it's really important that Bungie gets a lot of feedback for this. Uh, saying what you do like and what you don't like. Because if you only if, if people only go up to Bungie and they say, We don't like this, we don't like this, we don't like this. Then they're just going to try and dramatically change things. Oh, wow, they, pro they probably wouldn't. But I'm, I mean, you got they got to know what people are enjoying. and, and uh, but, you know, if, if there is something that you don't like as well, then it's important that within this beta, then you're going to be able to be telling people. So that's good. Um, anyway, I hope that all made sense because it probably might have done in my brain. Probably. I don't know. I've only just woken up anyway. I've already said that as well. Uh, anyway, that's been my Halo Reach sort of look over where I did some lovely little close-ups. So, my name's Jimpy. I'm probably going back to bed now while this renders. Um, I hope you have a lovely afternoon. Or morning. Or, you know, middle bit. Goodbye. Subscribe.